Hi, Mr. Devlin here. I get a lot of people asking me what I would recommend for a first person tactical shooter, primarily for my console subscribers, because as you know, I'm a PC player, but I do um, a lot of videos aimed at the console market. And uh, they ask me a lot of the times, well, what would you play or what is the on console that we could play that is more tactical and hardcore? I've got quite a few games on my radar and a lot of games I would like to tell you about and I think, you know what, I'm holding back because they've not given a definite indication if they're going to release it on the console. So what I've done is I've gone through the games that I've got my eye on and if they've mentioned the fact that even if it might come to the console, I'm going to start a series and let you know the games that I'm interested in that possibly or are definitely going to come to the console and be rest assured I'll make sure you know if they've definitely said it's coming to the console or they want it to come to the console be it this gen or next gen consoles so the first one on the list is 06 behind enemy lines I've had this title on my radar for a long, long time. But you know what? I'd forgot about it. And then I read something recently. And I think the reason that I'd forgot about it is because it's third person. Now, I'm not overly competent on third person shooters. But this game, I think I could give a chance. And I think it's something that the console players should be looking at. So let me tell you about the game and let me know in the comments below if you think this would be something you're interested in. And don't forget to um, follow the development team. I'll leave the description to their Twitter below and tell them Mr. Devlin sent you. Okay, so Zero Six is a tactical third person shooter based on teamwork and realistic combat. Experience a modern combat scenario, where the emphasis lies on outsmarting your enemy. It combines the tactical elements from a third-person perspective, with the action-packed shooting mechanics of an FPS game. The game will feature an object-oriented multiplayer, where tactical decision-making and team play is key. Face a dynamic experience, featuring close quarters combat as well as more open areas. Your action can influence how the next round starts, so players will constantly need to adapt their approach. It's also going to have an immersive campaign. The player will experience a dark gritty story that revolves around a Spec Ops unit, which is loosely based on the Navy SEAL Team 6. Besides a single player campaign, the game will feature a competitive multiplayer. Various tactical and team oriented game modes will be included. So let's talk about the competitive multiplayer. The development team are putting a strong emphasis on one life per round game modes. These are designed to run at a slower pace, meaning you will more commonly walk and peek corners instead of sprinting and jumping round corners. With predictable recall patterns and low time to kill, a mixture of individual mechanical skills and a tactical approach to positioning and movement will get you the win. All I know at the moment is it's been developed by a small independent team based in Germany and apparently there's going to be an alpha sometime this year. I've signed up for the alpha so hopefully I can get in there and show you some gameplay. So for the console players, are there plans for it to come to the console? And they say yes, we plan to release a game for PC first. The release on console is planned. There is no date so they're not promising anything but it's quite good that they're actually uh, indicating that it might come to the console. Having said that, they have not indicated if it's going to be released on next-gen consoles. I mean, it should be, but they have been, I think, a bit apprehensive. They don't want to make any promises, which for me is a good thing. They're not giving console players any hope. Um, they're just being realistic about it, and I'm sure they'll let us know in the future if it is going to come to the next-gen consoles. I wish I could have shown you some gameplay, but there's nothing out there at the moment. That's why I'm giving you screenshots on the back of this video so you can see what the development of the game is like uh, currently. 
Anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe, press that bell icon and tick it so you get notifications of when we're uploading new videos and this is Mr. Devlin hoping you're liking this sort of content and if you do, let us know in the comments below. Out.